What's up, everyone? Mark Loveliner, TigerFitness.com alongside. Rich Omi Sean, High Performance Nutrition. One of the biggest questions, believe it or not, asked on the internet is people search for rhomboid exercises. Because people want to know how to work them. Now, rhomboids give you back that beautiful three-dimensional look and give you that nice, um, that detailed graininess of the back. And a lot of people don't work them enough, but we've come up with a plan to work them efficiently. First, you got to know a little bit about the rhomboid. There's two parts of the rhomboid, major and minor. It sits right under the trap. Its main function is to pull the scapula into the thoracic spine. So that is what it does. If you understand that, then you understand a little bit more about how to train it. So what we've done for you is we've put together a three-part workout that you can add into the end of your back training sessions to fully and completely target your rhomboid minor and major. So essentially, you do your normal back workout, maybe cut down volume a little bit, and you finish with these three exercises, and they will get you on, on the track to rhomboids. I know you don't hear this. Rhomboids that girls will drool over. Them diamond backs, baby. Them diamond, throw your diamonds up. So what we have is three different planes of motion. We're doing a prone rhomboid retraction, uh, a shrug essentially, but focusing not on the traps, but on the rhomboids. So we're pulling straight back. Then what are we gonna do next? Then we're gonna do, actually we're gonna go on a cable, and yeah. we're gonna retract the scapula there. Again. So you're going on more of a, a motion down here than you're going up here. Yeah. And then the third one, you're gonna go up here. Right, so we're pulling, we're doing retractions from three different angles. From below, pulling up. From horizontal, pulling back. And from vertical, pulling down. Hitting three different angles working the same muscle. And mind muscle wise, focus on your rhomboids. Do not put it here, which you will naturally tend to do. Put it right, boom, right there. Let's get at it. There you go, squeeze right there. That squeeze, not here, here. There you go. Helps put your finger, if you're training with someone, put your finger right here, right between their shoulder blades, a little bit lower. That way they know where to focus. All right, so the key on this one is to not shrug up. You have to resist the urge to row up. The cue here is to pretend like your shoulders are poisoned to your ears. Isn't that right, Mark? Yes, sir. You have to keep them shoulders away from them ears. You're pulling back yeah. to hit the rhomboid. You're not trying to work the upper trap. Rhomboid. Yeah. Throw them diamonds up. Oh, that was awesome. Another thing is, don't curl it in, don't bring it. You gotta keep your arms nice and straight. Not completely straight, there's gonna be a natural curve in them, but again, your arms are just there to hold on to the weight. You're focusing all your tension right on the back. Right on them rhomboids. All right, so what you just saw was nine sets 
of a Diamondback Rhomboid Destruction workout that we just put together for you. Once again, we did a prone scapular retraction, a horizontal scapular retraction, and a vertical scapular retraction. Now the beautiful thing yeah. is, why, why do we do this? The scapular retraction, and we were talking about this earlier, it helps with all lifts, dead lifts, it forces you to learn how to use the muscles in your back. It also works on your mind-muscle connection, which is key. And also, it will help with scapula health, which will help with overall back health and just being a better human being. When you're talking about your, the ability to maintain the neutral spine that we've been learning about, to pull the scapula into the thoracic spine, you're gonna have a stronger deadlift, a stronger bench press, a stronger squat. You'll be better in bed, right there? You'll be better in bed. Everything in your life will be better, literally. This makes you a more functional human. So there you go, I believe this is probably the first rhomboid specific, use this at the end of any back workout you have, that's not a game.